How's it going everyone? This is Inca Statement and welcome to Subnautica Below Zero. This is early access. It is not fully completed yet, but I can't wait any longer. I have to play it. I love Subnautica. I've been trying so hard to avoid all spoilers for this DLC and you have no idea how hard, how hard that has been for me. It has been so hard and I've been so excited for this DLC. Uh, if you guys remember when we were escaping the planets right before we jumped to hyperspace we saw either the northern or southern I can't tell off the top of my head of the planet we saw polar caps and everything so this is where this takes place now I don't know too much on the details all I understand is we are a researcher studying the precursors and the planet so in this polar area, as you can already see, there's new creatures. There's also gonna be more that we will learn about the precursor uh, race, which I'm excited for. And look, these penguins are freaking adorable. I mean, look at them, they're so cute. They're actually pretty, pretty scary though when they open their mouths. Anyway guys, let's just get straight into this. I, I can't wait. Uh, survival. Yeah, because I'm not. I hate. No, no, no. Whoa. That is gorgeous. So, again, early access. Things are. There would be some bugs. There would also be some things liable to change. Whether it be. The story or how some things might work in the future. I don't know. I Again, I don't know what to expect. I don't know if there's even an end game. Yes. I, I, there might be. I'm not sure. Oh, I'm so excited for this. I am so excited. We are recording, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> That's... Uh... Here we go. Okay. Oh. Man, that's not like my fingers. Holy cow. I can't remember our character's name, and I apologize. Robin Goodall. Wow, that was convenient. <laughs> Why have you applied for this role? Everyone's talking about 40, 4546B. Who hasn't applied? Maybe Jeffries. No, Jeffries signed on last week. Why this assignment? The last time we found sentiently in life was straighter six, 17 years ago. It's been fun, but frankly, I'm bored and you have telepathic squid. I should tell you that rumors about spacefaring aliens on the planet are rumors. If that's why you're here, you'll be disappointed. I'm a xenolinguist. Spacefaring aliens are our holy grail. I want it, but I don't expect to get it. What qualifies you, qualifies you for this position? There are creatures out there you couldn't imagine, let alone understand. Do you know how I talk to them? I think you correlate responses against stimuli and I do what they do. If they bathe in liquid nitrogen and talk with their feet, I put on a coat and I pull a handstand. But this recruitment process, it's most alien of all. So I'm trying to correlate my responses here. I want us to understand each other. Put me on that planet. I'll talk with the fish for you. Thank you, Miss Goodall. Sandra? Sandra! Sandra will show you up. Sandra! Okay. If Sharon is back, I'm gonna be mad. Okay, so I'm just gonna go through these real quick because I don't, again, I don't know any of these things of what's going on back on this planet, 4546B. So I just need to get caught up. Blueprint license, uh, survival knife only, dang it. Cost incur, fabrication of unlicensed devices will be reclaimed from payroll. Okay, at least we're not getting everything. It, I don't freaking know anymore. The Vesper is a semi, Permanent orbital installation designed to provide a sustainable environment for research personnel stationed far from Federation space. Once 
In geosynchronous orbit of a target stellar body, it deploys ground crew and multiple go-to-space cargo rockets for energy-efficient resource transportation. In science terms, satellite that is able to drop and pick up resources from the planet at a set pace around the orbit to save energy. Uh, 45, 46, big, Aridine Arm. Okay. Um, forensic examination, recovery of Aurora wreckage, biomedical research, ecological preservation, resource exploration, and the fifth is classified. Okay. Habitation, oxygen generation, water filtration for 57 crew members indefinitely. 57 of us? I didn't know there were mo more people here. Or if there is. Capacity to support up to 30 ground. Okay, so this is just showing what it can handle. 30 ground crew simultaneously, 4 deployable ground-to-air cargo rockets for return of research samples, full payload of 1-use air-to-ground cargo rockets for ongoing ground support, and full science and engineering suits. Okay. Uh, blueprints. What do we have? We've got air pumps. Okay. Protection suit, scanner, repair tool. Well, that's good that we already have the repair tool, I guess. We got an aquarium. We don't need to read that because we already know what that is. Fabricator, habitat builder, good. And solar panel. Voice log. We are different, but we go together. Wait, how? Oh, okay. NB, all text and voice is not... Is work in progress and not representative of final quality. Emperor dream sequence, we are... Okay. I was about to say, what? <laughs> what the heck is... What is that? Ugh. I don't know what to think of that thing. Okay. Oh. Okay. Now let's actually look around. Okay, so that's us with the... Penguins? I'll call them penguins until I scan them and then I know what they are. Uh, inventory. Ah, nothing. Hey, peepers! Okay, let's... What the heck is that? It's like a sunfish with a hole through it. What the frick? Oh, this is cool. Alright, let's go. Enough googling around in that small room. Let's. This looks like an actual base. <laughs> no signal. Ooh, coffee. Ah. Give me the coffee. Ah, oh, you can't get back there. Okay. Is it not on? Okay, so that's the Vesper. Okay. Oh, wow! Look at that! Oh, there's a storm over there. Oh, I'm so excited to be back here. You have no idea how excited I was for this. I wish I could interact with more stuff. Okay, so... That's actually the bioreactor I never built. My last base. Ecosystem. Emperor produces enzyme 42. Peeper delivers enzyme into the ecosystem. Ecosystem relies on ecosystem for food chain. Yeah. Okay. So that's... I'm, I wonder if they did any research on the Kara virus. After, uh... Oh, crap. I just forgot his name. After our guy left. Okay, this is someone else's room. Okay, that's our sister. If I remember correctly, our sister is in the, uh... <gasps> yes! Uh, our sister's up in that station. While we're down here. So there are five of us in this crew. Weekly report, research base zero. Uh, samples categories five. Please rate your operations performance in your own words. We... And drill the nice tunnel to encourage a flock of penglings to surface near the habitat where we've been recording their behavior and assess a frozen over facility interpreted the symbols on alien control panel and hotwired it to accept altera frequencies 
I think we deserve a C plus. Performance, D. Please rate your satisfaction with Altera support. I give it a D. It'd be lower, but my sister's carrying the rest of you. Please describe your plan sets for self-improvement. I'm going to bed. So this is Robin and Joe. So us and Joe, who's the technician. Okay. Sorry, I I'm taking my time here. I'm just trying to, I'm just absorbing everything. Research of cultural or historical value is not included in the bonus scheme. Buyout still applies. Okay. Remember information leading to the activation of failing technologies is rewarded with automatic rights. Buyouts and a 10,000 credit bonus. Yeah. Which one was that one? That was the cleaning one. The one that, like, destroys all orga like, organic material in a certain radius. That's just the yin-yang thing that took forever to read. Okay. Why is that thing all over the place? What's to say? Cargo room. Okay. Anything in here I could use? Nope, but I found the greenhouse. Ooh, what's this? Task list. Harvest edibles from grow beds and plant new seed. To do. Translate symbols on alien artifacts 7 and 10. In progress. Send completed research samples to Vesper via rocket. Done. Continue investigation of the force field mechanisms at research site 0. In progress. Oh, so there's a, uh... A, uh... Precursor site here and they enabled it zero okay send weekly status report and progress varnish prawn suits to do repair weather station Ugh. perform monthly patrol of remote installations test whether pang wing flock are comfortable enough to swim with humans done yes <laughs> induct new support personnel to do so wait, is it pang wing maybe it's pang wing for the adult and pang ling for the babies. What's with the ambiance? This is weird. This is quite the base, I have to admit. Okay, let's go outside. What the heck? Oh, this is so great. Can I get in the prom suit? These are very cold prom suits, holy cow. Station Zero, this is Vesper. Come in. Hi, Sam. We lost contact with Jeffries up at the research site. Okay, I'll check it out. Understood. You know, the formal bit's cute, but we've shared a room. Would it kill your career to act like we'd met before? Robin, you know these conversations are monitored. I don't care who knows it's cute. I've been here two weeks. We've hardly spoken. Because you went straight to the planet. Find Jeffries. Chat later. Yes, Mom. <laughs> Well, you can definitely see who's the more serious sister. Okay. Uh, let's see here. What did we get? So this is about Sam, our sister. Born to a single mother employed by Altera on City Station to studied until age 16. Family recorded to Allwell, independent planetary research colony outside Altera space. Education suffered, but good all did not lose her cultural identity. Returned to Altera space as soon as possible to acquire digitraining and advanced management and Negotiation strategies. Wow. Surplus reduction, CMOTH marketing, alms communication, central. Holy cow, she has a lot. Extroverted, sensitive, thoughtful, judgmental. <laughs> okay. Wait. This. Really? No, I don't want to destroy the snowman. That's freaking awesome. I doubt I need that stuff right now anyway, so. So this must be the hole that they tried to drill. Oh man, that's nerve wracking. Just waiting for the ice to break on me. Okay. So I'm just, this way. See the freaking building off in the back. What the heck? I still don't have any items, so I can't scan or learn of it. Those heat waves kit coming off of it? What the heck? 
Interesting. What the heck? Those are weird. I'm guessing we're going the right. Yeah, we're going the right way. Whoa. I don't know what it is, but I love ice caves. They are so gorgeous. Holy cow. Wow. Wait. Why is this green? Is it like... I don't know. It makes me think of the ion cubes, but... I don't know. There's PDA on the floor. Wait. Access denied. Further efforts will be denied forcefully. Concede, Robin. What? How'd you know my name? I come in peace. Sam, the building just powered up. It spoke to me. Are you safe? It's never done that before. I'm fine. No sign of Jeffries. I've got an electrical storm on the sensors. Oh, well. I think it's already here. That cabin isn't stable. I want you to get back to Sam? Uh, Damn it! It knew our name! What the heck? Okay, so that's another way. Uh, real quick, I'm gonna read this. So, Alien Research Site Zero. During their occupation of 4546B, the mysterious race of spacefaring aliens refer to as the Almanac. Almanac. Oh! So they changed the name? I'm still going to call them precursors just because I'm used to that. Selected a number of sites around the planet in which to build their vast facilities with, while the focus of their mission to save their kind from the bacterium was the Emperor specimen contained at the primary containment facility. Their other installations served a variety of precautionary and support roles. While Zero Sector contains a number of now familiar alien sanctuaries, the alien facility in close proximity to the main research station remains one of the few whose purpose we have yet to discover. This will be the focus of our endeavors in Zero Sector. What we know is frozen beneath the ice hundreds of years ago, the facility lays dormant to this day. We progressed only through the first force field, gained access to the antechamber where a combination lock of a type we don't understand prevents further exploration. Whatever is inside is protected more thoroughly than anything else we have encountered. Okay. Interesting. Oh, my. Oh. I kind of want to go back real quick. I want to see where that other uh, path leads. Or if it leads anywhere. Freaking hair. Jeffrey! Jeffrey! Okay, so this didn't lead us anywhere. Better safe than sorry, okay? What is with these freaking ice? This ice going green is so weird. Again, I only can think of ion energy. But that wouldn't make sense, so I don't know what it would mean. Wow, what an electrical storm. Why do they call it electrical storm? Just call it thunderstorm. Can I climb this? Because it looks like I could. Aha! Wow, that is gorgeous! Holy cow! So we lost contact with the Vesper. Oh, this is so gorgeous! All right, let's get back to the base. I don't know how da how dangerous this storm is, but better safe than sorry, I guess. Oh my gosh, so good! Oh, there's a there we are. Okay.
Oh no! Oh, that's not good. Oh crap. Ow. Ah! Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. Can I? Snowman! Sorry, I need to destroy you. Oh, I thought I could take the tank. Now I feel bad. Well, where goes the research station? That just bad. That's bad. Your environment is no longer safe, and your PDA has rebooted in emergency mode. Be advised, high wind speeds will cause lethal exposure in four minutes. Emergency. Start here. Reading this, then you have survived the emergency evacuation of a station equipped. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, Arctic survival. High winds can result in hypothermia. Keep it out from the natural shelter or restorative hot springs. Uh, pack a lunch. Hot beverage always feels good. And appropriately dressed. Investigating any Altera cold suit is... You know, investing. When in doubt, don't go out. Yeah, whatever. Ah, we're back down to 45 seconds of air. Ugh. The heck is that? Oh, so this is the new uh, oxygen plant. Oh, that's so cool. Okay. Because the floor obviously is going to be pretty different here considering how cold it is at least Sharon hasn't spoken that's nice wow where are we oh bingos penguins yes yeah no I don't know if they're aggressive or anything, but I, I want to see them. Look at them! Hey, buddy! Oh, look at you! Oh, that's adorable. Robin, come in. I copy. I'm out in open water. Stay where you are. I'm sending a rescue shuttle. No, I'm oh. okay. I just need shelter. Fine, I'm sending a temporary habitat instead. Look up. Look in. Thank you, Sam. Call me when you get there. I'm looking. Oh. Hey, yo, buddy. Oh, they're so cute. Hey, buddy. Oh, look at the little ones. Oh, I can pick them up. I'm scared that the parents might get mad at me, so I will not. Hey, little one. Oh, those teeth are horrible. <laughs> All right, let's get to the shelter. Gosh, it is good to be back. Whoa, what the? Oh, that's a solar panel. New Why did I get a new? Oh, I got a whole. Ooh. Sam, I'm at the habitat. Any word on Jeffries? Nothing yet. And the facility? It said my name. I need to know why. I know. Make something to eat. Get equipped. I'll have answers by then. <sighs> you better. Will do. Alright, so what can we make right now? We can make a standard O2 tank, which we do not have currently. Okay, so standard O2 tank, easy enough. Fins. 
Scanner. Okay, so we got the basics. That's good. What do we have in here? Absolutely nothing. Awesome. All right, let's go. Let's get some food. New creature discovered. Ah, oh, Sharon, why are you back? Ugh. Okay, that's not gonna click on. Okay. So I'm gonna have to explore quite a bit because I don't know. Uh, grab trap. I don't know this map yet, obviously. Because again, I was trying so hard not to spoil anything. Come here. Boomerang! Okay. Thank you. Creature discovered. Oxygen. <sighs> I know, I know. Yes. I'm, I'm. I legitimately am feeling cold just by looking out there. Holy cow! Okay, we're gonna need you. New creature discovered. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You. Come, on, come, on. come here. Thank you. I'm gonna eat you. You too. Sea Glide Fragment, yes! Okay. So, definitely get the scanner first. It's gonna be our main priority right now. The sooner we can get the scanner... The... Oxygen. faster we can start getting some of our equipment. So, let's see here. Oh, there's another Sea Glide Fragment right outside our door. I love it. Okay. So let's... Get some food. Get some water. Okay. First tool is a scanner. We need a battery and titanium. Okay. Ribbon plant. Oh, look at that guy. Well, look at the peeper. Arctic peepers. They're so different. I love it. I don't... Again, I don't know any... Because we're de it looks like we're going to have to deal with new materials for building. Oxygen. Yes, I know, Sharon! Shut up! So we need ribbon plants. I think that's what we saw sticking out of the ice a few times earlier. But I'm not seeing any. Aha. Oxygen. <sighs> Get some more materials. Okay, right. there we go. Man, that thing was off-centered or something. Okay, some more ribbon plants. Good. Okay, we can make the scanner now, and then we can easily get the sea glide pretty dang fast, actually. So that's really good for us. Okay. So, battery. Scanner. Boom, bada bing. 
Uh, fiber mesh. Um, what's fiber mesh made out of in this one? Um, we need creep vine. Oh, so there is still creep vine around. Okay, that's good to know. Okay, let's put these in. Uh, I'm gonna make another battery. Can I... I need silicone rubber for that. And silicone rubber is creep vine seed again. Okay, so that's still around, surprisingly. One of three. We know one was over here. Oh, that's a graph trap. The graph trap actually could be useful because we can use it to get food. Okay, so we got that. And then the last fragment was here. Got it. Okay, so we got the sea glide now. I'm gonna go around a little. Eh. What do I need to build the sea glide with, anyway? I can make an air blighter now, that's kinda nice. Titanium loot. Okay, so I, I need to find creep vine. Good amount of quartz around here. Okay, if I was creep vine, where would I be? I feel like you'd be in a slightly deeper area. If it's anything similar to the last time. I there we go. Wait. I don't have a knife. So where's some seeds? Got it. Okay. So this creep vine's a lot different than Frap! So this creep vine's a lot different than what we're used to. I need to find some seeds. Then I can get some silicone. And then with the silicone, I can get silicone rubber to get the knife, and then I can get the knife to cut this, so I can get mesh. Get as much as possible. Get some more. Seeds are not as plentiful in this area. Huh, okay. Let's head back to base. I really need to make that <laughs> tank. If I could get that tank of oxygen, this will be so much easier. I have to say though, this looks absolutely gorgeous. I love it. A knife. Boom. And fins. Boom. Uh. Yeah. I'll make one more of those. Okay. So let's store you. Store. Old. Ugh. I need to eat those. Get some water in us. Okay, so.
All right. I want that on two and that on one. Okay, there we go. So that should be enough mesh. I don't know why I did that. There we go. Because I'm going to need that. Alright. Let's make fiber mesh. Standard O2 tank. Boom. Uh, Pathfinder F. Um. Okay, got that. Next, we need to build the Sea Glide. We need copper wire. Copper wire requires two copper. Oh, I can get the computer chips now. Sweet. So, for the first... Probably the first couple episodes, I'm going to mostly spend it trying to get... My base going. Uh, food set up, etc, etc. Just so we are in a good spot. So we can survive and then start exploring more of this planet. Oh, planet. More of this part of the planet, I should say. Alright, there we go. Got the last copper we needed. Okay, that looked weird. Alright. Copper wire. And... Where is it? Sea glide! Boom! Uh, let's make some food. I mean, water. Because water definitely goes down faster than food, so... Alright. Repair tool. Sweet. Okay. Just got all that. Um, what's the next thing I should build? I probably should get more equipment. Eh. I probably could. Flashlight would be good. I, I need to go get more ribbon plants so I can make a whole bunch of batteries. Because those are not as plentiful as the mushrooms were in when we were in more warm cli climate. So I'm going to have to go out for who knows. Gotcha. Want you on three. Ah, oh, yes. Wait, where'd he go? Might be a little. There we go. That's what I wanted. Grab some food. There we go. I'm actually kind of glad that we're back at the very basics again for this game. 30 seconds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just because I I really enjoy the the feeling of when you in the predicament that we're in, we're low on everything. We're striving just to try and get going. Oxygen. Signal location uploaded to PDA. What? Robin, the boss wants a sit rep. I'm cold, I lost all my gear, and I'm no wiser to what's going on. But I'm alive. I can't authorize another drop. Hold on. There's an emergency cache. Oh, good. It hasn't been touched since the scouts landed six months ago. Could be useful. Send me the cords. On your HUD. Sweet. All right, so there's a supply cache over there. I hope it has good stuff.
All right, let's eat some food. Drink some water. Let's go. So again, there's still so much I have no idea what to expect. So I think that's underwater. Ooh, we need more of these. Okay, that should be enough. I don't want to take up too much space. Uh oh. It was there. Okay. <laughs> I gotta be careful. Yeah, especially with this area, I'm gonna have to be very careful of my oxygen now because of all the ice. If I get, s there's gonna be a lot. It's gonna be a lot harder to get uh, oxygen in some areas. What? That's it? Okay, that's fine. It's not much. Not much, but it's something, I guess. Titan whole fish. Oh, so that's what we saw in that picture. Ow! What the heck bit me? Oh, it's you. So you guys are the new stalker fish, I guess. Okay. Okay, so we found a good spot for... There's nothing else here. Why does it keep telling me to come back here? Oxygen. Ah, crap. Oh, my gosh. Sanctuary in the Twisty Bridges. 200 meters down. I need to go back to the research site. I can't let you. Why not? Boss's orders. We're trying to keep you alive. Only because salaries cost less than lawsuits. Is that cynicism making you friends down there? Sure. They're just not human. The files are on your databank. Do as you please. Just tell me what you find. And don't get me into trouble. Oh, I'll get you in trouble. Don't worry. Okay. I'm gonna have to come back when I have the bigger tank because there's a lot to explore down there. What the heck? Okay, so... There's home. Okay. So disorientating. Okay, we're back home. Okay, let's read the PDA real quick. Uh, location data. Operating low power. Failed. So-called twisty bridges. An area dense with macro floor reaching 100 to 300. The fast growth of the tubular organic bridges throughout the area prevents a permanent route to the facility from being established. It can be located at a depth of 200, and contractors are advised to use visual reference to locate a viable path. The alien architects constructed multiple sanctuary facilities around 4546B. The purpose was to store and preserve the aliens' mental states for later retrieval in case of emergency. While many individuals fled to these sanctuaries when the Kara contagion was released, most succumbed before they could reach one. Of those sanctuaries we have gained access to, none have contained a viable alien consciousness, 
and it is further unclear what sense could be made of the data if they had. Okay. Spinnerfish, that is so weird. Very high speeds in a straight line, slow wide turning. Okay. Exploitable. Okay, so they don't have anything for this thing yet. That's kind of cool though. Okay, let's get some silicone. Uh, s uh silver, two glass, and four titanium. But that will have to wait until the next episode. Actually, I want one of these. Because <laughs> I don't know this map. I don't know this area. I'm lost. I'm just a lost boy. Well, girl in this case. I'm a lost girl in this case. I'm so, I'm so, I don't know what to expect. But I'm so excited to be back into Subnautica. Uh, this is going to be really interesting. And I'm really excited for this. Oh, I'm so excited. But thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Sonatica. If you guys are excited, probably not as much as me, but if you guys are excited to be back, leave a comment down below on what you guys are thinking what's going to happen. If you guys have any idea, let me know down in the comment section. If you guys have any ideas, or anything you guys actually want me to try, like if there's like a type of base you would want me to make, like a really big one this time, or anything you want me to try, let me know. And hopefully... New creature discovered. Shut up, Sharon! And hopefully this game will be just as fun as the last one. Anyway guys, see y'all later.